What's up, movie crew? So, I have some bad news. My local FYE is closing down. This sucks. If you saw my new release video when the Halloween 4K sets came out, then you know that FYE had me set up to get those. They got me covered. And now they are closing. I might do some talking about this on Instagram or on a live stream or something later if anyone wants that. But this is a movie channel, so a lot of you are probably wondering what I picked up. The only DVD I picked up is the limited box set of One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest. I'm going to carefully open this. So you can see why I chose to get this. And to anyone wondering, I didn't record when I was in there because one, they do play music in there. Don't want to deal with a copyright claim, but also it was very, very busy. So we've got, this is the movie itself. Yep, we got a two disc DVD, a patient file, some art cards, a deck of playing cards, and a book. Now I got to figure out how to get this stuff back in there. All right, we're good. So this was normally $12.99. I managed to get it, I believe, for $6.49, I think. Then we got Truth or Dare. Also got this one for $6.49. I thought, why not? Might as well go on in and check it out while I got it. While it's here. Also picked up the Sleepy Hollow Steel Book. That's right. I just got a used steel book, which is from the looks of it, I think it's actually like still wrapped in everything. Alright, so no, it has been opened. Never mind. But There's a quick unboxing for everyone. Not really much on the inside of that. But not every day that you get a... Let's see how much I paid for that one. $8.81. Got the ticket. Shout select title with a slip. This one I managed to get for $6.29. So, had to pick that one up. We got Happy Death Day and Happy Death Day to You. I got both of these, I believe, for $5.00. Got both of those. A never before open copy of Ma, also for $5. And because I have been talking about some A24 stuff lately, got Killing of a Sacred Deer. And then I also picked up because a trick-or-treat shirt. So I have no idea if the people at my local FYE are subscribed to this channel or not, but to the people that work there and to the people that have worked there over the years, I just want to say thank you, not just for like the shout out I did a couple weeks ago, but just in general. My local FYE has always had decent used stuff. I've been able to get decent Blu-rays over there when the Format Wars was still a thing. 
yeah, I know I'm showing my age a little bit. Whatever. But over the years, I've always been able to get stuff at FYE. And every so often, I even get something like a shirt. So thank you for always having some stuff. Thank you for the memories that I am going to have at this FYE. I have no idea if I will be back here or not before they completely close their doors. So there may be another haul video for them. This will not be my final FYE haul video. There is another FYE in the general vicinity of where I live. Just not promising anything. So there is what is likely my final haul from my local FYE. That's going to do it for this one. If you are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. If you like what you see, leave a thumbs up. Comment down below what has been the craziest pickup you have managed to get from your local FYE. But that's going to do it for this one. Thank you all for watching and tune in next time.